Hey guys, what is up? It's your boy Frick. So, so I know there's a lot of survival games on Steam or on other websites, and there's lots to pick from, and there's also a lot that are not worth buying. So I made a list of top three best survival games of all time. Disclaimer: This is my opinion. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. First on the list is Rust. The only aim in Rust is to survive. To do this, you will need to overcome struggles. Pick a server, load in, you start with a rock, you gather wood, resources, and make your first base. Make tools, equipment, and explore the map. Make friends or enemies. Make raidable equipment, raid bases, or get raided. Loot rat towns, explore different biomes, and survive. The PvP on Rust is amazing. There's always fighting, and if you don't like fighting a lot, and if you want to be a peaceful player, there's lots of servers to pick from. On Steam, the reviews are mostly positive, and the game is going for 35 bucks. It is a game with its price, hours, and sweat and tears. Next on the list is 7 Days to Die. 7 Days to Die is an open world game that is a unique first person shooter survival horror with zombies. You load in, you start with nothing, gather plant fibers, make tools, equipment, and hunt animals. Kill zombies on your way, build your home, explore towns, loot up for day 7. Because on day 7, there's a massive horde of zombies ready to attack you. The game is slow, but it's really fun to play alone or with your buddy. Although the game is a little blocky, it has a really cool survival feel to it. On Steam, it is mostly positive reviews on it, and it is going for 25 bucks. I think it's worth the price and hours. Last on the list is Miscreated. Miscreated is a multiplayer online hardcore survival game set in a post-apocalyptic future. You will need to survive against mutants, players, and even Mother Nature herself. Again, explore towns, bunkers, loot up, gather resources, build your home, and survive. Miscreated had its up and downs, but the updates that they put out are amazing. The game does take a lot of time to get into. I think it's worth it, but you have to see for yourself. On Steam, it is going for 25 bucks. The reviews are mixed, but I think you should at least try it for your out for yourself. Thanks for watching guys, hope you guys enjoyed. All of the games will be linked down in the description, so make sure you check down in the description if you want to try out these games. Make sure you leave a comment and let me know how you think I did. Or if you have another question, just let me know down in the comments below. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you guys know when every time I upload. Peace out.